there is a woman outside there, you are pregnant, right? You are due to deliver a baby right now. This is almost to the children when you deliver them at a little, just a baby, they die. They, when they just make, uh, uh, they die immediately. So you have this one now, the child is due. This is a baby boy. It's outside there. It's under the canopy outside. Jesus love you. Here we can see the woman the prophecy concerned coming forward from under the canopies at the overflow congregation. Just as the man of God had prophesied, the woman was sitting outside the auditorium under the canopies and was pregnant. She makes her way up the stairs, heading inside the main auditorium of the church to honor and confirm the word of prophecy that there was a woman pregnant with a baby boy outside the church whose delivery was due and that in the past she had given birth to children who had all died shortly after birth. Inside the church, she moves towards the altar to meet Prophet T.B. Joshua. It's your wife? Yes, sir. Where do you? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the reason why I say where do you is that uh, this is a solution. Where do you? Thank you, sir. Now, wow. the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Stretching his right hand, the man of God prays for her in the name of Jesus Christ. Immediately, there is a visible reaction in the woman as Prophet T.B. Joshua offers prayer under the influence of the Holy Spirit. This is prayer in the power of the Holy Spirit right now. Watch what's happening. Vous voyez le ventre de cette femme bouger. Elle agit contrairement à sa volonté. Le Saint-Esprit à l'œuvre. Estamos viendo la liberación de esta mujer como su vientre se mueve. Con respecto a una profecía diciendo que lleva tres bebés que han muerto en parto. Watch and see her expression. You can tell something extraordinary is happening to her. From the look of her face, you can see she's not comfortable. Look at her stomach jumping. Watch your screen, see what's happening. Her stomach is moving. This is a result of the prayer offered by Prophet TB Joshua just moments ago. So the child is Tony. It is the position the, this child has been, the baby has been coming out with. Before that baby coming out, a lot of wrestle. Doctor has been wrestling, the nursing has been wrestling. Before the baby come out, it has been become tired and died. But this time around, he has to re reposition to come out straight. It's Tony, before now it was bottom, but it's now Tony right. It's coming out with the head. So when it finish, you can take her to the hospital. How are you feel? What is happening in your stomach? My baby is rotating. The baby is rotating. How, mm. how? Because you are the one carrying baby, you know what yes. is happening in your stomach. It seems the, the baby is turning like this. Yeah? It's turning, rotating like this. It's turning body. Yes. Rotating like this. Yes. Yes. Mm. yes. 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 So, any moment from now, you feel some a kind of pushy. Something will come out like a bit, little water burst. After that, the road is open. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Vous voyez cette femme à qui l'homme de Dieu a donné la prophétie, disant que chaque fois qu'elle accouche, les enfants meurent. Elle est venue aujourd'hui, elle est en train de subir la délivrance et l'enfant est en train de tourner dans son ventre. Acabamos de ver el bébé repositionándose para poder dar la luz correctamente. El profeta ha dicho que después de esto, un líquido va a salir de ella y con eso va a estar solucionado el problema. So, the thing has come down now. The water I'm talking about. You can see the baby stop moving. 
because it is now finally repositioned. It's free. Okay. Take her to the toilet. Eh? Thank you, Jesus. After receiving prayer and the anointed wristband from Prophet T.B. Joshua, the lady is led out of the main auditorium to go to the lavatories and release the water that the man of God had prophesied about. Waving and smiling, she is followed by her husband as she moves through the church. Climbing up the short flight of stairs, she enters the lavatories and proceeds to pass out the fluid. woman came back with her bouncing baby boy to the synagogue church of all nations to testify to the glory of God in confirmation of the prophecy given to her by prophet T.B. Joshua that she would deliver a baby boy without an operation. Praise the Lord. Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Our names are Mr. and Mrs. Kingsley Alaribi. Man of God prophesied to me, there is a woman here that she has delivered uh, three children. First one survived, second one died, third one died. And the, the woman is outside the canopy, that the woman should come inside. There is a woman outside there, you are pregnant, right? You are due to deliver a baby right now. This is almost till it. Children, when you deliver them at a little, just a baby, they die. Immediately I come inside. The man of God prophesied to me that, that I have a baby boy in my womb, that the problem that caused the death of the children, that's a, a long, long labor, and I should go, that the problem has solved. He gave me a wristband, and he said that something that will, burst from my stomach. When he said that, he said I should go, that this baby will not die again. What is happening in your stomach? My baby is rotating. It's tiny body? Yes. Rotating like that? Yes. Yes. Mm. yes. 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 So, at the moment from now, you feel some, a kind of pushy, something will come out, like a bit, little water burst. After that, the road is open. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Everything man of God has said has come to pass. After every, after the prophecy, we leave and go back to Imo State. Reaching to Imo State, I went to my doctor. My doctor said that he would book me operation because of the problem I, I've been having. I said no, that the, prof, the man of God, Prophet E.B. Joshua, had break the yoke, that I am not going to do any operation. I used the wristband and prayed. Told the doctor that I'm, going, I'm not going to deliver this baby with oppression. Immediately he leave me and go. Coming in the morning, I used this wristband and pray and, and put it on my stomach. I said that as far as the man of God had prophesied that my baby is not going to die, my baby is safety and secured by the hand of the Almighty God. Before the, the doctor came, I delivered my baby so fast without oppression. And this is the baby boy. You can see that it's a baby boy. Everything that man of God has prophesied to my life is true. The, the second baby died. Even I didn't come out with the baby. The third one died inside that favor room. That's how the prophecy come. And you can see now that this one now, Prophet T.B. Joshua has prophesied. And this thing has manifest. And I'm alive. My baby is alive. Emmanuel. Praise the Lord. Praise the living God. Emmanuel. Emmanuel. 
My name is Mr. and Mrs. Kingsley Alaribe. We came from Imo State. During the time of second service, man of God processes uh, that a woman there outside the canopy. That's whenever she delivers a baby, the baby will cry uh, uh, and die. So when I had the prophecy, I told my wife, this is our prophecy, that the Lord have remember us. Do you remember what I told you that day? How I make joke? He said, where well done, Oga? I said, where well done, Oga? Yes, sir. What's the meaning of that? For the job, where well done, because the stomach was too big. <laughs> After the prayer, I thank God today because the Almighty God have used Senior Prophet T.B. Joshua to bring a laughter in my own family. And now I have a baby boy, first son, because the, the first one I have died, but I'm happy today that I have a son in the house. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs>